looking live high above the American Airlines Arena, courtesy of Sky 10, as we are getting you ready for Game 5 of the NBA Finals seed right here on Local 10 at ABC at the top of the hour. Your Miami Heat against the Oklahoma City Thunder and a chance for history tonight to win their second NBA championship, and they've got a chance to do it on the home court. Speaking of the court inside the American Airlines Arena, the Thunder would night nothing more than to, of course, not allow that to happen. Tabo Sevalosha there working out before the game. Only Thunder players remain on the court now. The Heat have finished their pregame warm-ups. And as we take you back outside, let's give you a ground level as fans continue to stream inside. I am told that it looks like it could rain any moment, but that's okay. No one can rain on the Heat's parade tonight if they can win a championship. So those 19,000 plus getting ready, white hot style to get in here and possibly see some history. A little while ago, he was on this court. I mentioned the Heat players are done warming up. T. Wade was on the court here, getting ready, working on his dribbling, working inside and out. D. Wade ready, hopefully, to have a big game for the Heat tonight. But also, Kevin Durant, as we know, the Thunder star, one of the young superstars in this league, hasn't really played all that well in this series. He scored some points, but hasn't had that explosive game. Arriving earlier, he's hoping to have that big game tonight. The Heat are one win away from an NBA championship. Win tonight, and that dream is realized. The big three have their first title together in Miami. Back to Harden, and Harden lays it in. But as we found out in game four, it doesn't come easy. The Heat fell behind by 17 points in that game in the blink of an eye before battling back to pull out a 104-98 victory. Here's where he initially fell. LeBron James played through painful thigh cramps and came back from a brief break to nail a sensational three-point shot that broke a 94-all tie and helped the Heat win their game. Bang! LeBron James from downtown! Mario Chalmers turned in the most memorable game as a member of Miami. With a three. Rides into the occasion after a slow start and ending up with 25 points. Westbrook again to the basket. Again, he puts it in and a foul. The Heat needed Mario's help to overcome a 43 point performance by Oklahoma City's Russell Westbrook, who was virtually unstoppable. But it wasn't enough for the Thunder, who now trailed the series three games to one. No team has ever overcome that deficit in the finals to win it all. The Thunder will try to buck history. So tonight it's game five, the Thunder and the Heat, the final game at the American Airlines Arena this season, and hopefully a climactic end to the season for the Heat. You know, it's always been a dream of mine, even when I first picked up the basketball and started to get into the history of the game and, and uh, you know, develop, um, you know, how you know, great it would be to hold that trophy up someday and be a part of a championship team. But, um, you know, it's been a long process. Um, and it's going to continue to be a long process, but you know I'm in a position now where I can uh, be a part of history. So, you know I have to do my job, and as a team we have to do our job to, uh, you know, to make it happen.